AOK Ousu, the national president of the Association of Rural Banks Ghana. Business basically deals with managing risk. Even the Chinese describe uh, risk as taking opportunities. The opportunities are there, and if you are not able to manage them well, then it becomes risky. And looking at our banking environment this time, there's uh, somehow crisis. And this is uh, evidenced by recently withdrawal of uh, seven banking licenses of uh, universal banks. And the central bank has also come out to say that they are in the process of us also streamlining the other microfinance institutions and rural, rural banks, as well as uh, savings and loans company. And since business is basically managing risk, then you must be able to put your loans together so that the business that you are managing is managed efficiently by adopting all risk factors that can mitigate any possible losses that uh, will degenerate into loss of confidence in the public. You know, banking thrives on confidence. And if people lose confidence in their system, then the system will, in the long run, fail to exist. At the end of this uh, program, we wish to update update the knowledge and skills of the participants in risk management and fraud pre uh, prevention. And for that matter, to improve overall the internal control measures in these banks. If your internal controls are very strong, then you can have a strong risk management factors, which can also mitigate the essence or the, 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 the awareness of what preventing fraud. You see? It's the human beings, even though we have these uh, prisoner rigs, uh, market rigs, uh, uh, credit rigs and all those things, it is the human beings that are the main drivers. So if you're able to understand those issues, especially the board and the management, in fact this program is being organized for board and then management and other staff, so that their understanding will create awareness as to certain measures and policies that should be in place rather to avert these unnecessary risks that eventually lead to loss. A defect on rural, rural bank affects the rest. Already rural banks didn't start on a very good note. In fact, it has come a very long way. And once uh, people are beginning to gain confidence in them, we must be able to let them sustain this confidence by helping them to operate.